You're listening to the Amazing Facts Daily Devotional. Today's topic, Real Strength. The heaviest car ever balanced on a person's head was 352 pounds. On May 24, 1999, John Evans of England balanced a mini on his head for 33 seconds. John was around six and a half feet tall and weighed 343 pounds at the time. He also had a strong 24-inch neck. The trick was dangerous because if he stumbled, he would not have been able to move quickly enough to push the car aside. You might be surprised at the feats of human strength people attempt these days. Tyler Yamauchi holds the world record for Roman rings hanging duration, 32.84 seconds. What are the most push-ups done in one hour? On the back of one's hands? Patty Doyle did 1,940 reps on November 8, 2007. But some records make you wonder. Zafar Gill of Pakistan broke a record that would hurt your ears. He lifted a 160-pound gym weight with a clamp attached to the lobe of his ear. The Bible talks about how we should really use our strength. Paul writes, We then who are strong ought to bear with the scruples of the weak and not to please ourselves. Romans 15.1 A chapter earlier, the apostle introduces this idea. Receive one who is weak in the faith, but do not dispute over doubtful things. Chapter 14, verse 1. Evidently, there were Jewish converts who had some doubts about religious practices. Paul calls some of these practices doubtful things. In other words, there are some practices that are scripturally sound and should be followed, keeping the Ten Commandments, for example. But there are others that are based on traditions of men, how to wash before eating food. If people are genuinely seeking to follow after the Lord, strong Christians should be considerate of them. They should not use their strength to hammer others over the head. A judgmental attitude might damage other Christians, especially those young in the faith. You might be tempted to break a world record by lifting a weight with your earlobe, but it is much better to use your ears to listen and to care for other Christians new in the faith. Our key Bible text today comes from 1 Corinthians chapter 8 and verse 9. But take heed, lest by any means this liberty of yours become a stumbling block to them that are weak. Thank you for listening to the Amazing Facts Daily Devotional.